This is Jimmy here with uh, Jimbo's Great Adventures, and today we are going to flip the axle on my utility trail. All right, so right now, the clearance that we're getting right now on the, from the wheel to the fender isn't very much. I'm wanting to get bigger tires. Right now, we're probably at about, uh, probably about two inches right here. I'm going to adjust that. So basically what I'm going to do is the bolts underneath here, right where the axle is bolted to the leaf spring, I'm going to take that off and I'm going to flip it around to where the axle is riding underneath that. Got the tires off. You got to take the tires off before you do this. But down here there is a bolt right there and then it kind of just hooks up into here. So I gotta take this bolt out and release the axle and then I can flip it up underneath the spring. All right, now I've got the clasp connecting the, or holding the axle onto the trailer right here. So now I can pull this out and let it down. Okay, I now have one side done. I basically, uh, did one side at a time. I took this leaf spring out first. That one's still attached over there. All right. And now the axle is underneath the spring. All right. So we now have both sides underneath the leaf spring. I'm going to put the tire back on, both tires back on, and see how much extra clearance we have. All right, now we're back, and now the leaf springs have now, or the the axle is now underneath the leaf springs. So now you can see how much extra clearance you have. Uh, before I think it was like two inches. Now we got about six inches of clearance. So as you can see, transferring the axle down below the leaf springs adds quite a bit of clearance. Uh, now I'll be able to grab uh, bigger tires for it. Uh, thanks for watching my video. Please subscribe and like below. Thank you.